look at this. Isaac Haxton picks up Queens. He's not even the chip leader, not even in second place, but he's the one that wants to put the pressure on. And Isaac but picks up Kings again. Can Pascal call him? Uh, he folds. Isaac is having a good time so far. Queens again. Let's open. Do you shove here with Queens? I shove him. Let's get it shove in. Him. Shove yeah. him in. You gotta shove him in. Isaac Haxton, the silent killer, came to the final table. Ten big blinds. Dips up, man. He's just... He's too yeah. solid. Solid. Oh, this solid can get player. feisty. I'm expecting a race here, right? Of course, re-raising is skipping going to be a plus EV play. I'm just curious to what Isaac thinks of the situation. Wow. Okay, that's so way big. bigger than I expected. I think he wants to force the fold. Malaka might not fold days then. I don't know. We've got a call. And what a scary flop. Oh. The small bet. Probably it's going to get uh, Malaka style to continue because there's a lot of chips to play for. It's a, it's, a, it's a nasty spot, and uh, the king's good not card. a good card. The thing is, ace-10, it has showdown value. The board kind of breaks out. I mean, there is a flush draw that completes. I feel like the ace-10, it's so hard to turn your hand to a bluff now because most time you're expected to bet the king on the turn. This you win cool sometimes pre-flop. Um, I've got a feeling he's going to do it. I have the feeling that Malaka sells. He's on fire. No, he doesn't do it. Okay. I, yeah. I understand that. For the final four players, the pay jumps are so much bigger. Uh, you can see. Yeah, now that's it. Cole? Cole, he goes go. with the threes, and he's ahead at this point. But Isaac is running hot. So far, the threes are good. Oh, oh. neat. Oh. No. oh, and it's a low red card, but it is not the three that Finn Peasant was looking for. Unfortunately for Finn Peasant, came in as a chip leader. It ends here. Means we're now down to three. Yeah, no. It's all Isaac Haxton right now. <laughs> <laughs> Isaac makes a pair of fours, but Stefan with the king queen of diamonds picks up the flush draw. Is he going to check or bet? Can you really go either way? Um, goes for the check. Of course, the king gets there, but I don't think the king queen was going anywhere anyways. And look at Stefan. He's just thinking, man, this Haxton's going to bluff this king. Let me go for a check. You got to go for value now with the king queen. If you don't go for value here, it's... Pot size bet and an immediate call by Isaac Haxton as well with his four. So well done there by Stefan. Picks up a big call. This could get funny. Limp call maybe the standard, but limp jam is not out of the question of deuces because it plays a little bit poorly post flop. Yeah, okay. GG. Oh my goodness. <laughs> call immediately as well. Full of confidence with his eights. So let's see. Are we going to get a deuce or not? Stefan Huber is now in a fantastic position and he does to take down a massive pot. Malaka sells. Will go out in third place. We got a surprising heads up out of nowhere. And Austria versus Canada. It kind of had to be, right? <laughs> Want a chop? There is no chop, Stefan. We removed the chop for this tournament. The thing is, Isaac Haxton might not know there's a chop anyways, but he said, play. Okay. <laughs> I love stuff you would be like, oh, sure. Good luck. It's like, no. Oh my God. Like Isaac just took down a monster pot. Okay. He just took a massive mental lead at this head. So this hand can get really feisty already. Wow. Should he just call? Should he raise? Really either way is going to go for the big raise. And now that's Stefan here. So I'm just oh. going to call. And he does call. <laughs> What a turn. The four yeah. of clubs will complete the flush for Isaac Haxton, but it also means that Stefan Huber now picks up a 10 high flush draw. I mean, Isaac is going to bet big here. He might just shove, no? He might just shove. Oh, the check. But oh, that is so sneaky. And the thing is, Stefan Huber has got a bluff now. He's at king high. This might be over. Yeah, it what a be. hand. Oh, over. he shoves it's and over. he gets snap called by Isaac Haxton and that means it is all over. This could have been a long heads up match. All the chips gone so fast. Isaac Haxton is now officially the winner of the fourth edition of the High Roller Super Millions.